Final ride. <clears throat> Okay. I'm making spaghetti for my whole family. Unfortunately, <clears throat> I can't eat pasta, so I have alternatives. First thing we do is to make sure we have spaghetti sauce that is low in carbohydrates. For a half a cup, it's only 10 grams. So we're looking at a really good combination here and only 50, uh, 50 calories. And on top of that, I use riced cauliflower blend. This one here is broccoli, cauliflower, and carrots. So it's a really good alternative to use. And I'll show you what it's like after it's all done. So I have a pound of ground beef with peppers and onions. You can also add uh, diced tomatoes if you like. And you add a little bit of water, just not very much, just enough to get the rest of the tomato sauce out of the jar. And mix this all up and let it sit and simmer for a little while. cooking we're gonna get our spaghetti and get another pot okay now they got that in they got their spaghetti made so now I got one cup of my spaghetti sauce Like I said, one cup will be 100 calories, 20 grams of carbohydrates, which is great because you want to stay 60 to 80 carbohydrates per meal, which is excellent. And we my scissors. <clears throat> and this combination here, it is Three quarters of a cup is a serving, and I like using my portions. So this is total calories, 60 calories, 10 grams of carbohydrates, and it also has dietary fiber, which helps slow down the ingestion of the glucose. We're gonna mix this all up real good and give it a good mixy mixy. And you can add another vegetable of any sort that you would like. Right now I'm making broccoli for everybody. Which again is more dietary fiber. Little to no carbohydrates and only 40 grams of carbohydrate, uh, 40, 40 calories. Cover and let this reheat and you'll be good to go. And again, nice low carb versus 42 grams of carbohydrates just in the serving of the angel hair pasta. And it doesn't give you that bloaty, I've eaten too much feel. And of course we got our broccoli, which is excellent. And you can also cheat a little bit and have a breadstick if you like. Uh, we got some served over here. They're 80 calories, but of course, no dietary fiber, and you have about 15 grams of carbs per stick. So stick with just one if you want one. And this also tastes excellent. Speaking of breadsticks, there they are. All right. And down on top of this, add a little extra Parmesan cheese. The ideal. And this whole serving right here, wonderful for eating 
something that makes you feel good, full, and doesn't give you all those calories and carbohydrates and fats that you don't want. And again, I used one pound of ground beef, 90-10, so it's only 10% fat. You can also use uh, lean Italian sausage or ground beef and sausage. Or ground chicken is also really, really good. Very high in protein as well. So stick around. I'll give you some more tips. And hopefully you'll like what I just made. Y'all have a blessed day. And here we go. One satisfying meal without all the carbs and fats that you need. And I guarantee it will fill you up. So y'all have a blessed day. I'll talk to you soon.